Okay, so what are your trail names? She's Jingle and I'm Bill. All right. Because of our bear bills. Oh, so as you're walking, it's making lots oh, of noise? Yeah, it, yeah, I cut it down before I got here so that I wouldn't wake up anyone in the oh. shelter. So have you come across any bears? Yes, we have. How many? Um, I've seen me. one. Yeah. She <laughs> had one just last week. Week before last, last. when we were in Vermont, uh, it ran across the trail and stopped. And I guess it heard me coming and it stopped when I stopped. And I turned around and looked and he was still scrambling around. And so I thought, I'm going to get a picture. <laughs> so I, when I reached, that got his attention. He turned around and stood up on his hind legs, and we were looking eye to eye. Oh, no. And I'm like, okay, either I can ring my bear bell or I can try to get a picture. So I rang my bear bell, and he took off. Yeah. So I didn't want somebody to see my last moments captured on my cell phone. So, <laughs> so how long have you guys been on trail? We started last March uh, uh -huh. until the week of Thanksgiving, off and on. And then we did a 14-mile stretch this February and came back on in March and off and on. So okay. we'll hope to finish up next August in Katahdin. Nice. So. Nice. So you're heading, which way are you heading today? Southbound. So, Southbound. so your, your strategy, can you explain your strategy? We pick a section we're going to hike, and then we, when we're uh, section hiking it, we look and see the terrain on Gut Hook and see which way we want to go, which was the easiest to hike. That's good. That's good it. strategy. Good strategy. So thank you for letting me uh, interview you, and I wish you well on your trail. Okay. Happy trails. All right, we just left Goddard Shelter, and it was kind of misty most of the night. Uh, a little bit of sprinkles. Today the sun's supposed to come out, and it's supposed to have a heat index. So we'll see how that goes. We'll either do 8.9 today to a shelter, or there's some camp spots by a brook. Um, so that's at 11.5. So we'll see how Terry's knee holds out and make a decision as we continue along. So second day out, uh, after getting back on the trail, and you know, your body knows you're out here. So anyway, we just came up a hill and now Nice and flat up here. All right, here's the fire tower outside of the shelter, but it's very foggy right now. So we are going to pass and keep on moving. All right, Terry, what did you think of the trail today? Tough morning. Yes. Uh, a lot of downhill, uh, wet rocks, and my leg muscles felt like lead. <laughs> it's so. definitely a tough day today, mostly rocks. So you definitely had to watch where you were going. Wet rocks. Yeah. at Kid Gore Shelter. It's 4.1 miles from Goddard and it was a rough, rough hike today. I'm hurting. My hips are bruised. I gotta take a look at my pack and figure out what's going on. But we ended up with a nice view so you can see behind. And it's a very nice day today. Not as muggy as yesterday. Although we were going uphill more yesterday. Just getting out of this shelter, it's going to be all uphill for a little bit. And then we got a decision to make at our next shelter uh, if we're going to push on for another three or if we're going to call it good at 8.9. Check in then.